Simona Halep of Romania joins the list of top women's contenders to fall before the fourth round at Wimbledon. Michael Steele Getty Images, Wimbledon, England, and then there was one. The decimation of Wimbledon's elite women's ranks continued Saturday, as world know. One in top seeded Simona Halep was upset by Su Wei Xie of Taiwan, 3 6, 6 4, 7 5, before a stunned crowd on court one. With the result, only one of the tournament's top 10 women's seeds remained. 7th seed Karolina Pliskova of the Czech Republic. That represents a stunning winnowing of the field before the tournament has reached its halfway point. To say that the Grass Court Classic has now opened up for lesser known players with dreams of winning a Grand Slam is an understatement. It also has opened up for the most accomplished women's player to grace center court, Serena Williams, who counts seven Wimbledon championships among her 23 Grand Slam titles and may well not have needed any draw-clearing upsets to clear her path to an eighth. Williams is seated 25th, an accommodation reached by officials of the All England Club who are aware that her 131st ranking bears no relation to her true ability but is, instead, reflects her 13-month maternity leave that ended this spring. As Wimbledon's top women's seeds keep falling, who will grow a set of fangs, Halep, a 26-year-old upon whom virtually all of Romania's sporting hopes depend, was on top of the tennis world just last month when she won her first Grand Slam title, the 2018 French Open, with a gutsy comeback against American Sloan Stevens. The achievement added credibility to Halep's number one ranking and made her the pre-tournament favorite here. As top seeds tumbled all around her in Wimbledon's first two rounds, including defending champion Garbine Muguruza, Australian Open champion Caroline Wozniacki and Stevens, the reigning U.S. Open champion, Halep appeared on shore and steady footing for the July 14 women's final and a potential meeting with Williams. Halep had won her only previous meeting with the Shad, 32 five years ago in Cincinnati. Primarily regarded as a double player, the Taiwanese entered Wimbledon ranked 48th in the world, never having advanced past the tournament's third round. For most of the 40,000 who swarmed into the All England Club for Saturday's matches, there were four requirements, sunscreen, hat, water bottle and silenced mobile phone with BBC IT player installed for monitoring England's World Cup quarterfinal against Sweden. Wimbledon officials have declined to show the matches on the grounds, so soccer mad tennis fans are on their own to keep up with the scores. Halep's court one clash with Shiet was a baseline hugging affair in which neither player served well and both committed more unforced errors than winners. It also dragged on two hours 20 minutes longer than it took England to declare victory over Sweden, 2-0 and book its place in the semi-final. Read more, at Wimbledon, the kids are alright, but the grown-ups win the trophies a safe bet, legal gambling could change the way we watch, talk and experience sports at Wimbledon, a rediscovery of and renewed appreciation for its magic Tiger Woods vs. Phil Mickelson for $10 million. What's not to love?